Do you have any other native pine tree with three needles to a fascicle? Not native. Name something else. Not native. Anything else? The answer, not native. The answer is no. So this is pitch pine. The short answer is needles of three, it's pitch pine. And even from over there, I don't have like binocular eyes and I can count three. I could see they were longer. There's another one right there sticking. It's longer. And behind it is a Virginia pine. So pitch pines are threes and they're long. They're not as long as loblolly or any of the others. But get that anyway because it's the only native one you've got with three. Now later, you're going to learn short leaf pine, which has twos and threes on the same tree. Weird. Okay, but for now, don't worry about it. You only have this one with threes. Now we'll go look at the bark and some cones on a big one. Very flat and pretty much a repeated rectangle. Rectangles all over the place. It's fairly thick, so it's pretty fire resistant uh, tree species in this part of the Appalachians. We can look up at it and again look at length. Okay, from the air, you know, we're looking at them close. Now look up in the sky at them and look at the size of the cone. The cones are about three inches long. And we'll pick some up before the day's over. Maybe you can look down at your feet, maybe there are a couple. The, uh, the cones are bigger than Virginia, but smaller than table mountain. So you want to get a feel for as you look up, okay, how big will they look up in the sky? Okay. Virginia's going to be like two inches max. This is three, sometimes even four. And Table Mountain is that huge ingrain, heavy thing. <laughs> if you ever see green needles just coming right out of the trunk like this, little tufts of needles growing, and we're going to see them. These are the clumps of needles coming right out of the trunk from dormant buds. That for sure is a pitch pond in this part of the country again. And we'll see, they don't all do it, so don't, that's not like a signature piece. They, they have these hidden dormant buds that if there is a big fire, uh, sometimes they'll sprout out from those things. Or if their top gets broken, a whole bunch of them will come out.